and what has transpired, it will mean that we seem to be at a crossroad. Solo. No, I mean, one of the things that uh, the lawyers in this country, together with the judiciary, has succeeded in inflicting on the people of this country is to confuse all of us. Why? Why do you say they that? They have damaged every Ghanaian. Now you don't know which is which. The same letters lettering them, the same constitution, written black and white, yet people are coming with all sort of wild interpretations. You mean, you, you think we are going just helter-skelter? Absolutely. I mean, I'm very surprised with what my brother Ishak Ibrahim is doing this morning. I was in the MPP in 2020. I never heard him say that the speaker's ruling was wrong. He never said it anyway. Yet today, conveniently, he's saying that he disagreed with Ma Michael Quay. That cannot be. When the general secretary of a political party writes, what it means is that the party, that is the party's position. Party says the moment you declare that intention of contesting as an independent candidate, you are not part of them. Which I agree. General secretary writes to the speaker, speaker act on it and gives a ruling. By virtue of that, the man is taken out of parliament. Someone just told me this morning that the karma that used to work was karma slow. Now we have karma fast. <laughs> Who told you that? Oh, and my old lady said this karma is too fast. <laughs> I mean, just four years ago, people that are arguing, that are running to the Supreme Court, told us that this was the position which was affirmed by the Speaker of Parliament. And the same facts, same circumstances, and even the same personality, character involved. The same people have come back and telling us that, oh, that is not the case. Looking straight into the faces of you and I and insulting our intelligence. Why must we allow that to happen? What are you saying? That it, the MPP, it smacks of double standards? The actions of the MPP is just insulting the intelligence of Ghanaians. Take it from me. How can you say it that? It is total insult. That you just said yesterday that uh, someone left your party to contest as an independent candidate and by virtue of that must be cleared from parliament, which, was, which decision was taken that you have to be cleared from parliament, is today telling us that that cannot be the case. And you think it's not an insult into our intelligence? Can any MPP member confidently tell me that now they consider Cynthia Morrison as part of the MPP? I don't understand. What do you mean by that but pronouncement? Because it is automatic. Cynthia Morrison is no more a member of the MPP. Kwajo Asante is no more a member of the MPP. By virtue of the they, rules they've set for absolutely. themselves. So, 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 where, I don't, look, don't allow anybody to bring legal technicalities to confuse you. If the constitution was meant for only lawyers, then they shouldn't be selling to ordinary people. <laughs> if the constitution, because selling a constitution to me means you are written in simple language. Why do we make this so difficult? So, so are you saying that the Supreme Court, yeah. as well as the other individuals, the protagonists yeah. or the antagonists in all the story, yeah. whether it's Afenio Markin, the bulk of the MPP caucus, etc., yeah. are not reading the mood of their supporters in the country? No, they are only deceiving them. Deceiving? Yes, giving them falsehood. It's falsehood. Look, this was the same speaker. I mean, come to think of it, Roland. In less in 2020, when we went to the polls, Daniel gave the NDC 137, MPP 137, that was the case. Since when this, the mathematics told you that 137 is greater than 137? So it means we didn't have a majority parliament and we didn't have a minority parliament. It was equal. It took the same speaker to say that the independent candidates had told everyone that he was going to do business with the majority, uh, the MPP, and by virtue of that, uh, the MPP became the majority. Did we not live with it? And if today the speaker is telling you that, hey, by virtue of what has happened, four seats are vacant, we have been told that this speaker cannot be right. I agree with the speaker that those seats, four seats, must be declared vacant. Indeed, they are vacant. This futuristic thing that is being introduced here, where is it coming from? <laughs> 